We mentioned before that this model comes with a DX3S, which includes real-time telemetry. What that means is that there are sensors on the car which relays information back to the transmitter, and you can actually read it out on the screen that's being held in your hand. Let's take a look at some of the really cool features of this. First of all, we have a temperature sensor here that goes into the head of the motor between the fins. This senses the heat of the engine, sends that information back to the receiver and back to your transmitter. There's also a speed sensor. Speed sensor is mounted right here on the model and it picks up the RPM based on this little dot of this input shaft on the differential. There's a calculation just like a small computer that's being done inside the radio which takes the size of the tire and the speed of that input shaft and calculates your miles per hour. Okay, we mentioned the telemetry and the readout on the transmitter. This is the screen on your transmitter where you can read all of the pertinent information and all the important things that you really need to know, including the voltage that's available for the transmitter itself, for which there is a, a warning that should the batteries get low, it'll start beeping and let you know that the batteries are indeed getting low. There's also a readout for the receiver batteries, again, with a readout letting you know when they get low. Perhaps the most uh, exciting part is the uh, readout for the speed or the RPM that has a uh, look just like the speedometer in your automobile. As the car goes faster, this needle will, will move and also give you a readout here as to what the RPM or speed is, depending on how it's set. And of course, we have the temperature, which right now is 75 degrees, which is our room temperature. But if the motor was running and getting hot, you would see this slowly move forward and this readout change. And that can be set in both Fahrenheit and centigrade readout.